All right, this is your boy, Mr. Sin. I'm with none other than Funk Ghost. What's up, y'all? Uh, tell the people what's up. Tell the people all the monikers and all the, all the aliases that you go by. This is Brandon Traffic and Funk Ghost. You know Velvet. Uh, Funk with Lovin'. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yo, I don't know. As a kid, you know, I had problems. So when I grew up, it just came out to multiple personalities. And it also came out to, to a very successful creative genius uh, who's right now embarking on his third video, third music video, which yep. I was invited to and happened to be a part of. And um, I just want to ask you, man, you know, the inspiration for that song, the inspiration for your, for your videos in general, where's that come from? Because you've been in the game for a while. Right. Where's this new, like, this new Right. Well, that's a great question. I wanted to do something that was different. Um, I always love to reinvent myself. I think of myself as a black David Bowie. You know, somebody that can reinvent himself and, and, and continue to do uh, great music. As far as the latest video, uh, I'm your DJ. You know, it, I figured, you know, DJs are the, like, my man Sandman, what's up Sandman, the group, are the cornerstone of hip hop. I wanted to flip it up to where it was something where, you know, I can make it a, a metaphor uh, for not only uh, talking to a woman, but, you know, something that was universal. The stuff I want to do now, I want a lot of people to like. I don't want it to be in a box. Okay, I don't want it to be uh, classified as just strictly underground or, or strictly hip hop. I want it to be universal, and that's where I am right now. Uh, 20 years in the game, doing music. I want a lot of people to be able to relate to my music. So that's where I am right now. That was that's probably the, the reason for the most significant change of uh, why the music is going that way. So you know, and I'll tell you right now, I've heard I've heard the, the songs the songs that I have heard, man. I'm impressed with. And I know that you get an overwhelming uh, response, man. And I just wish you the best of luck. Thank you so much, and I respect the basics, you guys. Uh, the whole hip, hip hop community, DJ Sandman, uh, the basics, Dynasty. Uh, you know, you, you can name many acts uh, that, that are from our, our city. That's burgeoning laws. Uh, that has a major buzz right now. Um, you know, that influences me as well. So yeah. I thank, I thank you all uh, for, for contributing to, to what we're all doing. I got a roll. Well, let me tell you what, man. Um, to add to that, man, you. you you were one of the trendsetters in this area for, for doing uh, you know, hip hop on a high level, on a level that's not uh, of this area. It's, right. it's, uh, everything that I've heard from the jump was always, uh, you know, it had the sound of world being world. You know, and, and it inspired us as the basics to, you know, think outside of the city and think uh, in terms of bigger things, bigger, bigger, you know, bigger planes and things like that, man. And, right. You know, I can tell you right now, man, with, with, the, with your, your strategy, if you want to call it a strategy, uh, uh, the, the, the singles and kind of shooting the videos right. and things of that nature, man, I think it's very smart, Thank you. especially with the way uh, people receive music and receive the media and stuff like that now, man. So I really, I really want to applaud you on that. And, and let you know I'm one of your biggest fans, and that ain't no bullshit, though. I know. Like I'm I a said, big fan of Basics too. Real talk. Uh, like I said, a lot of the acts that come from the city that people don't know about that are burgeoning, uh, building their own fan base, actually uh, drive off that energy as well. Yeah. yeah. Um, and the Basics and uh, Dynasty. Like I said, many acts, many acts from this city uh, is what drives me. Yeah. You know, and it helps me to take it to the next level. So. Uh, for that, I thank y'all. You know what I mean? Real talk. Real talk. Well, you know you're my dog, man, and, and, and let people know where they can find you and, and find some of these videos that we're talking about, things like that. Well, you can not only find it on YouTube, but if you just go to Google, search Funk Ghost, you can find it everywhere. Um, you can go to iTunes, Rhapsody, uh, what else? Amazon, my first album that I put out in 2000 is up there. Um, you know, it's just a grind, you know, and, and what I'm trying to do is, uh, you know, try to sort of uh, reinvent the game in the aspect of, you know, you don't have to have a major label deal to do your thing. We've got Grand Extravagant Entertainment going. There's a lot of uh, great acts that have their own thing going. Go and check it out. Go download it. Uh, and discover new music. That's all. That's all I want to say. That's what's up. And on that note, what are we drinking tonight, man? Hey, man. I walked in here with a Cardi and a Styrofoam cup. <laughs> uh, right now, I'm drinking a big ass pass.
ribbon sort of tore down right now, but you know, much respect. I love my fans. Uh, drink and drive safely. You know, I'm not trying to condone no uh, drinking and driving, but you know, it's a blessing. You know what I mean? Uh, just to be able to do music and do do what, what I like to do. I thank God, and uh, you know, I love my fans. Slop, funk, slop, real quick. Slop Funk does. What, what's the status on him? And have you have you spoken to him recently? Um. Haven't spoken to him physically recently. I always uh, see him on Twitter. He's out in Phoenix now. You know, he's like my little brother. So, you know, you. I wish so. him the well, the best, and, and, and uh, you should be hearing some stuff from him real soon. That's what's up, bro. I appreciate it. All right. Respect you already know, man. What's up? It's your boy Funk Goes, Mr. Sin. 813 all day long. That's what's man. up?